Oh, it was quite a long time ago. Uh, first, I use objects uh, in the first work of mine, which I did actually uh, in a gallery in Poznań. It was in uh, 1967. Uh, but uh, because of some special reason, uh, the audience has destroyed everything in a very aggressive way. So I stopped working with objects for quite a while. I was working with words and drawings, conceptual uh, way. Then uh, in the 80s, I started to use them as kind of fetishistic matters. Но на самом деле он сделан с использованием предметов, которые обычно применяются в секс-клубах. But uh, especially I concentrate on uh, objects at the beginning of 90s. Uh, first trying to replace words and concepts by objects, trying to check how do they work as concepts as well if they can be used as a kind of vocabulary. That was my beginning uh, of the adventure with the object. Actually, it is the first, the primer for the work. Uh, it didn't exist before, so I made them specially uh, for this purpose. However, it is related to a series of works which I did in the middle of the 90s, a series of soft protections. And there were Danish version, uh, Swiss version, Polish version, Great Britain and Northern Ireland uh, version, and the museum version. This is the uh, Russian version, especially made for the exhibition in Moscow. All the soft protection works deal with the same uh, context, political context. I mean, they do deal with media as a source of our recognition of the world. And in this case, in the whole series, I use me uh, newspapers in a very ironic way. I mean, the newspapers are balancing uh, the furniture. They make everything stable. What is, of course, uh, quite a sarcastic uh, question. Sometimes uh, I use furniture and I destroy them or I keep the works. Sometimes uh, in a, for the peculiar, peculiar works I borrow uh, the furniture so they are taken from a domestic context, from daily life context, replaced from home to uh, art space and by simple replacement uh, they change their identity I mean they are becoming different status they are becoming artwork but they are only artworks for a certain period of time it means that uh, while the exhibition is on uh, they are art objects after the exhibition is finished, they are going back to their domestic uh, surrounding and they are becoming daily objects again, if they are not destroyed. But usually I don't destroy them, only in case of uh, such uh, work. Well, there is a historical uh, strong connection from the beginning of 20th century uh, among all these uh, constructivists, uh, among Malevich and Streminski, Kobro and Lisicki and uh, Rothschenko and Tatli. I mean, they were traveling and exhibiting here and there. Uh, Streminski is a Polish artist but born in uh, this part of the world. Kobro uh, is half or quarter German or quarter Russian, quarter Polish or Jewish, I don't, I don't know exactly, but anyway, uh, 
the exchange of ideas and similarity of ideas, I think, was very strong uh, uh, before the Second World War, uh, in the time of great avant-garde.